Welcome to my new and updated Hourglass Recipe Farm. The Hourglass is a furnishing recipe that is one of my all-time favorites. It can be found under your blacksmithing station, under diagrams, under the parlor section. Here's the recipe, and here's the product. Okay, welcome. We are at the Kavachwe Shrine, which is a part of the Dock Brotherhood storyline here in the Gold Coast. Right here on the big map. Okay, so travel to that way shrine, and then we will head on in. It's a good idea to bring um, your highest level thief or just make sure you have some points into pickpocketing. And another very, very, very helpful tool is getting your Dark Brotherhood Blade of Woe um, so that you can keep this farm going over and over. Blade of Woe is really simple. You just do the Dark Brotherhood storyline. I think it's like the first or second the peer person you talk to they give you the dark brotherhood blade of woe okay so we are now in this section right here so the square we are looking for priest now be wary there are guards patrolling which is why it's very good to be on your best thief so we'll just give give it a second, let this guard chill out. But as you can see, he is a priest. Only priests drop this recipe. Okay, now the guard is doing her patrol. You have a second. We will be pickpocketing twice and then blade of woe. Don't forget about that guard. Is the guard looking? Nope. We are free to kill. Oh no, I got caught. But that's okay. Stay hidden. Go around the guards. Now, if you come this way, this is where the other priests will be. Now, there's generally a guard patrolling that way. I don't see her. Okay, so she's already dead, but you can get some of the NPCs out of the way so that you can more easily pickpocket the priest. There is a priest right here. And then at the beginning of the maze, there is a smith. So the smith can see you with the priest. If you want to make money, you know, pickpocketer, blade of rower down. Because I'm going quick, I'm just going to put her down so that we have no witnesses while we sit here and try to calmly pickpocket this priest. Oh no, she caught me. And sometimes that's how stealing goes. You might get caught. She'll turn back around. When you do get caught by the person, the suspicion never really goes away. So I would just quickly dispatch her. Check to see. Nope, no recipe. And that's pretty much the circle, okay? So we have a priest here. There's that guard I was warning you about. And then we had a priest here. If you make sure to pickpocket, pickpocket, kill, they will be back up in a relatively short amount of time. I enjoy going around and breaking into houses and, you know, looting as I go, waiting for them to respawn. 
Now I want to show you the best thing about this little section in farm is that let's say we do get in trouble with a guard. So here we go. I'm going to poke this guard. Hey, what's up? All right. So he's mad at me. If you do get caught by a guard, you can very, very easily escape him by jumping up here. Like he still grabbed me and stuff. All you got to do is bail out into the water. When you bail out into the water, you see his red dot up on my compass. He will eventually go away. Um, guards can't enter water, so that's a really easy way to get the heat off you. And then you can swim on over here. And there are a, there is a set of stairs right here. And there it goes. Aggro gun. Okay, so I th hope this tutorial was helpful, and uh, good luck farming that hourglass recipe. Uh, it does take many, many, many times over. Don't get discouraged, but this is the easiest way I have found to get it. Thank you, and have a good day.